It was no secret that Harry Anslinger was an extreme racist and conflated drug use with jazz and with being black. Many of America's top black entertainers escaped to Europe where they didn't face the harsh racism that they encountered stateside. But the stereotype followed them across the pond. After British authorities interrogated a man busted for marijuana possession, he told them he'd gotten it at Club 11, a famous jazz club on Carnaby Street. The following Saturday night, April 15th, 1950, police raided the club, making several drug arrests. The drug bust made headlines in all the British papers. But Brits were forced to confront their stereotypes about people of color and drug use. You see, everyone busted at Club 11 that night was white. Back in the U.S., new, harsher laws were being created for marijuana possession. We'll tell you about that in a minute.